Oh, no. Sure, I would talk about the folks in my riding who also work in the tourism industry that uh, in an industry that's 85% women who are independent travel agents that work out of their basement or their home office and there's nothing in there for them. So don't pretend, don't pretend. Because we've heard this again and again and again. And the fact is, look, we support getting help in the way that the government <laughs> you know, says they want to help certain businesses. It's not that we don't want the help to be there for them. But this divide and conquer strategy of the Liberals to hive off certain groups and deliver help to them while abandoning other people like independent travel agents, like, like uh, a lot of people who are working in the arts and culture sector who are still waiting on some kind of program when all they had to do was be included in the Canada Worker Lockdown Benefit uh, in, without the requirement for a lockdown. There are ways the government could be delivering help to a lot more people who really need it. Bill C-2 is about the basic structure of Canada's recovery and it's a complete failure from that point of view. So stop with the pretending that somehow uh, we're against helping the few people the government wants to help when we're clearly making a statement about the nature of the recovery and all the other people that need help that this government isn't there for.